but they say you don't face the bucket enough, that you're not as offensive a player as you perhaps could be. How do you respond to that? Uh, you know, I, I look at those things and I, I try and weigh each one and value, value it and try and figure out, you know, is it really true? And especially when it's coming from the experts, you know, I'll take it down very seriously and I'll try and work on it. But the scoring part of my game has been something that I've been most, you know, aware of lately, and especially in the last two years. And it has, you know, picked up dramatically. You know, I think it's, you know, my rebounding has always been so consistent. It has overshadowed a lot of the things that I've done offensively. But I'm becoming a lot more offensive-minded, and I know that I have to be for next year, you know, if it is to be for me to be in the NBA. That's interesting. If it is to be for you to be in the NBA, you don't accept the, the possibility. I mean, you, you accept the possibility that it won't happen, perhaps. Well, I, I look at it, believe me, as a... Um, sort of a blessing from God to be even uh, on the Olympic team as well as in the NBA because less than 1% make it every year, you know, and that, that's a very low percentage and the odds are heavily against everyone.